I just bought this relatively inexpensive wooden pallet and it doesn't appear that the manufacturers sealed it very good. I can still feel the wood grain. I'm going to show you today how I would seal up the wood and get it ready for painting. I've laid the wooden pallet out here on a comfortable flat surface and I'm going to be working some linseed oil into the pallet. Don't worry about using any fancy artistic linseed oil. Save that for your paintings. You can just use the regular inexpensive boiled linseed oil from the hardware store. Instead of using an old shirt or just a cheap rag, I actually like to go one extra step and use a lint-free rag. These are the, the types of rags you buy for cleaning glass. I think it's well worth the extra pennies. I actually restore a lot of old hand tools this same, using this same method. Okay, I'm not going to put a real heavy coat on. I would get a much better result if I wipe off any excess linseed oil that I've added and then just let this dry overnight and then I can add another layer or two. Um, you'll be much better off if you add a few thin layers rather than trying to add one heavy layer. So as you can see, there's no pools. There's not a, an excessive amount here. So we'll let this dry and we'll come back to it later. Here I am about a week later. I ended up adding three coats to this palette using the linseed oil. And I let each coat dry overnight and then I gave it a very light sanding with the grain with 400 grit sandpaper. And then I let that last layer of linseed oil dry for several days. This palette looks and feels great. I can't feel any of the wood grain. I can't wait to put some paint on this and use it. Don't forget to go over to HelloArtsy.com. I've got tons of free resources, articles about learning how to draw and paint, and everything is 100% free.